Hey you guys, this is Beth from Dainty Daisy Merchandise. Thank you so much for stopping by my channel. I'm a part-time reseller and a stay-at-home mom. Our unboxing this week is gonna be from Goodwill Blue Box from South Hackensack, New Jersey. We still do have our unboxing for the rest of those single earrings and we will do a part two to that next week. So thank you all for watching and I hope you guys enjoyed that single earring lot. have a bag this week oh it looks like some nice colors I love some color let's go ahead and dive in I hope you guys have had some decent weather we have been getting a lot of rain here in Georgia a lot of cold weather and a lot of rain my two least favorite things so I hope you all have been doing well All right, so first up is gonna be, ooh, looks like maybe some malachite, that beautiful striping in there. I like that it's in this little, little spring ball there. I'm not too fond of this. Okay, it looks like it's a pull through. Not really fond of that. It's a little worn out, but I do love the pendant and very pretty stone in there it's just free inside just sits inside there so if you're interested in this one i will do it for eight dollars i can replace that chain as well if you'd prefer a chain i can keep it on here but i will most likely replace that chain If you are interested in a piece, you are welcome to look in the description below where you can find a link to my Etsy and my Poshmark shop. You can also email me and I use PayPal for checkout. Oh, I love that stone. Reading in that glass area. Very beautiful. I don't see any tags or markings on it. I like the feather. Definitely a nice resellable piece. Looks like all these are gonna be some earth stone too. I will do this one for $8 as well. Okay, it looks like we have come out of our glue there. Oh, it's tough. Alrighty, maybe some kind of plastic in there. Very cool design. All right, that definitely needs some work on that pen. It would need to be glued back in. I will have some lot box pieces. You guys will hear me say that throughout the video and I will sell those for $1. So if you're interested in a lot box piece, be sure to email me. All right, looks like we got a pretty good reading there on that. I might've just been hitting metal. Let's see if I can get it again. Might hit, might hit some diamond on there. Let's see if we can find any other markings. All right, we do have a marking, 14K. Oh my gosh, right off right off the bat here, guys. So BH, 14K, that's great. Let's check with Magnet. All right, looks like we have some 14K white gold, diamond hoops, it looks like. Maybe some white sapphire. I'm thinking it's gonna go to diamond if I can get it. Hit some metal. Presidium will make that noise. It might just be a sapphire which is still awesome, love a sapphire. All right, that's great, great start to this box. We'll set that aside, see if we can find the match. Lovely costume earring. Gotta check those posts and the backings. Don't see any markings on this one. Still a beautiful costume piece. I'm missing a stone. I'll set that aside, see if we can find where it goes. 
I love getting from New Jersey. They have some of the best boxes in Florida. Those are some of my favorite ones. Lead works. It looks like maybe some leather. I like the rainbow on there. I will do this one for $3. You gotta watch those wrap bracelets because I have found Chan Lu before, which is a very high end wrap bracelet company. And they sell for over $100. I've sold a couple of those now. We got our first little tangle here. Let's see if we can get out. All right, maybe something came out of here, it looks like. Maybe there used to be something that was in there. Okay. Definitely giving me Western vibes. It's got a little bit of wear on that leather, so we're going to set that aside, put it in the lot pile. All right, another awesome earth stones here. I love these shiny beads. Looks like this is gonna maybe like tie together. Like maybe you can loop it around because there isn't, you know, no clasp on it. It looks to be open, but I love these. Reading in the glass. This one kind of looks like sea glass. Beautiful. This one's got some more color in there. All right, I will do this one for eight. Lovely piece. Some really cool pieces already. Leah Sophia. That's another great resellable brand if you are new to reselling. Leah Sophia is a great brand for resell. I will do this one for 10. Love that. Of course, it's not going to fit my fingers. Otherwise, I would keep it. You guys know I love my rings. And I actually have my sizer out here. This looks like we're going to be sitting on a six for that Leah Sophia ring. Our little chain, like mesh necklace. All right, we do have a marking. Nine two five. Oh, that's awesome. Nine two five. Looks like maybe there's a number on it in Italy. Awesome. So this is going to be a nine two five necklace with the knots on it. I will do this one for 15. Beautiful work on there. Pretty earring. I love when they do the backs too. So when you're wearing it, it looks like it's all the way through. I love the attention to detail on those pieces. Don't think I see any marks, but let's test these stones. Oh, hitting metal. Alrighty, no movement on there but still really pretty hope for a pair oh okay we got the match some of these stones are turning a little bluish color on there but we do have a match sometimes only one earring has a mark so always be sure to check both earrings if you find a match to it lovely pair there i will do that one for eight So we did find the match to this one. I will do these for $2. I don't think I see any marks on there. Let's check it with the magnet. Just a little pull there. So we will do, almost looks like tiger's eye, a little tiny tiger's eye. Yeah, it is. Looks like some little tiger's eye in there. You see that one? Very shiny. I will do these for $4.
All right, gold hoop here it is magnetic, so a nice costume piece. No reading on that. It does have that M mark, so if you guys are familiar with that marking, I don't recognize it, but if you guys know, please let us know. I always like to spread the information on this channel. I'll do this one for $2. It's a lovely necklace. I've been doing a lot of arts and crafts inside with my kiddos, trying to keep them entertained. I've been doing a lot of painting. If you guys would like to see some of my paintings, let me know. I do enjoy painting. Pretty little rose quartz on there. It says gold on here. Okay. I got a reading on the quartz. The pearls do feel gritty. Gold M. It's the same M as this necklace. Same color tone too. So let me know if you know that brand. Ooh, this is a very heavy pendant. Very heavy pendant on there. Lovely beaded necklace. It's magnetic. I will do this one for five. All right, costume piece with some missing stones. I'm going to put this one in a lot. Magnetic chain bracelet, no name brand on there. I will do this one for $1. I do encourage you guys to sell those no name brands. Those are some of my top selling pieces. All right, I'm gonna do these both for $1 a piece. Another magnetic bangle. I'll do that one for $1. Thank you all for participating in our giveaway this month. It's always so much fun to do these giveaways with you guys. And I have another upcoming giveaway that's really exciting. I'm gonna be doing a collaboration with one of my favorite brands. So you guys be on the lookout for that. Like I said, maybe next week we'll be doing that next giveaway I'm trying to give you guys a little christmas gift 14 karat gold filled it's got some purple hues in it really pretty so lovely gold filled let's see if we can find the match even without the match i do keep those single earrings i am collector of single earrings but i do like to sell them as well All right, this has bows and it has these little chain link swirls. I'll do this one for $1. All right, let's look at this large pendant necklace. It's giving me bohemian look to it maybe even like an aztec look the metal is just a little bit worn on the on the links there a little worn on that chain not too bad but definitely got some wear to it i will do this one for three dollars i love the green stones right, let's look at this one sade designs maybe that's sadie sadie i'll do this one for two dollars lots of earrings today i'm not going to complain they've been pretty good so far all right another chain link look don't see any markings on that one and no match so far oh look at this pretty thing 925 thailand 
It's got some of those green stones in it too. Maybe some marcasite in there. All right, we're not moving anywhere on those green ones. All right, looks like we have a match for those gold chain links, so I will do those for $2. It looks like it matches those other bangles. Nice stack of bangles over there. If you want all of those, I will give them to you for $5. C&L, I've had this brand before. I have sold this brand before. Can't remember what it's called off the top of my head right now, but it's a resellable brand. It's gonna be layered. A couple layers here with that little drop pendant, it looks like. Almost looks like some feathers. No, very sparkly. I'll do that one for three. All right. Okay, so this is Charming Charlie's with a gold chain in there. Let's test the it's magnetic, put it in a lot. I will do this one for $2. Plastic beads, very long, Charming Charlie's. It looks like we found the match. Oh, is it broken? It's definitely might need some work done on it. Looks like it's a little, little bent there, 14 karat. So we did find the match. If I can get it clasped together. We didn't find the match for that one. Awesome. So diamonds, 14 karat gold hoops there. Or sapphire. Was it sapphire? I think it was sapphire. Let's test them again. All right. Nope. We're going. Looks like we're going to be going to diamond. Almost. <laughs> okay. Lovely set there. I'll do some research on these. See if I can fix that little wiggliness on there too. Beautiful. Awesome find. see any markings on that one. Put that in the earring pile. Catherine Popesco, France. I've sold her before. I think it was, God, it was some kind of watch or something like that I've had of hers. And it sold for pretty good money. So I will do my research on this one. Gorgeous pendant. All right, we found the match to the gold filled. We've got a lot of matches today. Match to those gold filled. Oh my gosh, look at that purple. It's so pretty. Look at that shine. Is that like a moonstone? Like, what is that? That is gorgeous. Look at that. Okay. So I will look these up to make sure, but I'm thinking I'll do these for maybe 15 to $20. Oh, I cannot get over that purple. All right, we have a little A ornament. I might have to keep this one. We've got a lot of A names. All my boys and my husband start with an A. My middle name starts with an A, so we're, we're an A family. I think I'll be keeping that one. I think I saw a marking on this one. Yeah, it looks like we have a 925 large hoops. They are thin, very light hoops. I will do these for 10. Lovely set there. Looks like we have another A. These wire necklaces drive me crazy. They get so easily tangled up. There we go, little wiggle. 925 again. Lots of silver in this box and gold and diamonds. Precious stones, we've gotten a lot in this box so far. 
So we've got an A. I might have to keep this one. Getting an M to add for it for my little girl. We would be in business. I think she's the only one that doesn't have an A name. <laughs> All right, I love that. I will do this. All righty, next. Another 925 Italy. Another A. All right, it looks like E, A, B, maybe. I think I'll keep that one. Got a little jingle there. Got some glue on it. Maybe I'll peel that glue off because those would be really cute earrings. Found a match to those wooden bead ones. I'll do these for $2. Grandma with a heart. Magnetic. I'm going to put that one in a lot. There's some discoloration on there. All right. We found the match to that other... Earring. I think we found almost all matches today. I'll do those for two. Henry Bendel. Oh, that's so gorgeous. I've got so many rings on today. Oh, oh my gosh, it's so pretty. I don't think it'd fit. No, <laughs> it's going to be a ring finger ring for me. Oh, these are so hard not to keep. I love purple too. Give you guys a size. Looks like it's probably sitting on a seven. Lovely, lovely ring. Very beautiful. Nineteen twenty. And I will do this one for two dollars. Very nice box so far. Definitely going to make my money back. I love these boxes. Some people don't like them. They say, you know, they've only gotten junk. I think, you know, you, you win some, you lose some. I've bought, what was it? American Thrift Supply before. I bought two boxes. First one, amazing. Second one, not so great. And I haven't bought from them again just because I get such great stuff from Goodwill Blue Box. But I just can't really complain. And I know I'm going to make my money back on those boxes. I love this. Oh, are these look, almost looks like lacrosse. I actually, I actually played lacrosse in high school. Are those lacrosse? I don't know what those are. What is that? What do you guys think? Looks like a lacrosse net. 925. I love that with the X on there. What do we think? What is the X? Really cool. I'll do that for 12. You're always going to find your best prices for my items on this channel. Oh, I love the disc choker. Very cool. Very noisy. Lovely. I'll do that one for eight. Oh, this is a colorful piece we saw in the beginning. Very shiny. I will do that one for eight. A little stretchy ring there. I'll probably give that one to my niece. She loves rings right now. All right, we found the match to that other one. It's kind of in the pile there. I'm not going to dig it out. I will do that one for three. All right, found the match to that one, but it looks like it's broken, unfortunately. So we'll see if I can fix it. A little abstract, abstract flower there. Clip on earring. Found a backing to that.
I will do this one for two dollars. Got a good pile in the lot area. Choker there with those little black stones. No movement. Very beautiful. Let's see if it's magnetic. It's not magnetic. Okay, the chain. So I will do this one for three. Another bangle, I'm gonna be putting it in a lot. Sometimes I do sell those. All right, that says sterling, so we'll keep that. Sometimes I do keep those. Just in case for repairs, always try and reuse items. Ooh, look at that, shiny. Kind of giving me a 925 look on it, but I don't see any markings. Let's check these little shinies on here. No movement, it is stretchy. I'll do that one for $3. Okay, Sarah Coventry. Giving me a vintage look. Looks like it's missing the little flower center in that one. I'm going to put this one in a lot. I right, found the match to that. To this earring. All right, I'll do those for $2. No markings on them. Very bright green on that chain. I'll do this one for two. Alrighty. Put that in the earring pile. Kenneth Cole. Great item for resale. Pearls. Do have some grit to them. All right. All the pieces are there, it looks like. Tasseled earring. Another one of those bangles. Vintage looking earring, tassel earring. hat there. Don't see any markings on it. I'm going to put that in a lot. Found a match to that tassel. So if you're interested in those, I'll do them for $1. Looks like we found the heart match. I'll do those for $2. All right, here's our broken piece. I'll have to see if I can replace that. We found our match somewhere in here. Okay, there it is. So I'll do those for eight. Oh, it kind of matches. Almost, not quite. I'll do this necklace. Has a clasp in the front. I will do this one for $2. Another pretty costume. I like this bangle and I will resell this one. I'll do that one for two. Is this another one that ties in the front? I'm thinking that's how this one's gonna go too. Okay, so we have two separate ones. So that one. 
And there's this one, very similar to that other necklace that we saw earlier. It's going to maybe just tie around. Looks like these are going to be a pair though. So I will do both of these for five. Do that one for $2. Love the detail work on that one. Junior Stewardess. I'll do that one for $1. Beautiful little shell necklace. Do that one for $1. Looks like we found the match. Christmas one. Okay, that's where the jewel came from. Bam. So I can glue that back on if you're interested. I will do these for $1. Definitely give me a vintage look. Size five. Had a little wear on that metal, just a little bit. I love the little jewel in there. I'll do that one for three dollars. Lots of silver and name brands in these. These could almost match those heart earrings. Same kind of metal on there. I'll do that one for two. Long chain. Put that one in a lot. Ooh, maybe got a little quartz in there. Okay. Hope for a match. Oh, look how pretty that is. Oh, we found the other match, that other tassel. Oh, I love the pendant. How gorgeous is that? Beautiful work. Really pretty. Stretch band, I'm gonna put that in a lot. Put that one in a lot as well. Here we go, we got another shell necklace with a heart. Oh, it's so cute. Ooh, I like how it's like more yellow on this side. Looks like maybe there's a coating on it. Lovely. I'll do that one for four dollars. Oh, we have a little religious bracelet here. It says Italy. All right, I will do this one for five dollars. All right, my kids would probably like to have that one. Put that in a lot. We're almost down to the bottom here. Looks like we got some jingle bells. That'll go to my babies. Little locket. How cute is that? I'll do that one for eight. I love a locket. I think I've always loved lockets since I was a kid. It's got a little magnetic pull to it, but this is a nice bracelet. I'll do this one for five. Vintage style earring. It's magnetic. I'll do those for $1. All right, looks like we got another match. We can get them untangled. There we go. J. Crew. So it's going to be a J. Crew earring set. I'll do those for five. 
I love the striped look on those. Looks like we have a very stretched out, put that in a lot, bracelet. All right, right around the corner from Christmas, we got some jingle bells. I'll do those for five. Oh my goodness, what is that? Ooh, almost looks like opal. Almost like a moonstone too. That is gorgeous with that wire wrap too. Looks like we have a marking on the chain. D-A-S-O-N, Dason? I'm not too sure. What is this? What is this stone? What do you guys think this is? Let's see what the reading is. Reading in that glass area. Love that blue stripe in there. Ah, oh, looks like we found a match to that 925 with that greenish stone. I'll do those for 12. Coro. I've got some Coro pieces. Might have to keep this one too. Vintage brand. I'm going to put that one in a lot. Kind of matches those tassels we saw earlier. I don't see any markings on those. Ooh, a little tiger's eye look. On this set. All right, cool. I'll do those for five. It looks like this is missing. It's backing maybe. That could definitely be turned into a pendant though. Another costume piece. Lovely tassels. We've got a good bit of tassels today. Right, another match here. Let's see those pearls. No grit to them. All right, I'll do those for $3. Ooh, look at that lovely. J. Crew. Thought I saw the other one. There it is. Looks like maybe there's a missing little stone there. So maybe I just take this one off. And it's missing a stone in there. So we'll see if I can replace those stones. Cool earrings. Got the tortoise shell on the back. All right, that's going to go. Oh, very magnetic. Four leaf clover. put that in a lot. All right, Leah Sophia bead there. This kind of looked like it matched that necklace. Nice size pearl there. Oh, I love pearls. If you know me, you know I love pearls. Canvas, I'll do that for $1. I love this. How gorgeous is that? In R, so that's going to be an Avon piece. Gorgeous costume piece. I will do this one for five. Wood bead brace, I'm going to put that in a lot that in a lot. Looks like we found another one of those gold backings. 
Another tassel. We might found the match to that other one, so we'll do that for five. Holy Bible. See if I can get it open. There we go. <laughs> Jesus loves me, this I know, for the Bible tells me so. All right, I will do this one for 12. Snake brooch. I'll do that for eight. I'm going to put that in a lot. I have some kind of paper on here. S and D. It's got a little jewel back there, too. Magnetic. I'll do that one for one dollar. Earring. All right, we did find the little piece that was missing. I don't know if I can repair that though with it being broken off. From that J. Crew earring. Another earring. This is a very stretched out bracelet. Oh, I love that design little bird there. How gorgeous, that damascene. Gorgeous. All right, J. Crew Mark. Another pair. We'll do those for 10. All right, Sterling. We found one of those already. We'll put that to the side. Looks like another vintage pair here. Do those for two. Oh, look at that. Charming Charlies. It's gonna be a very like dark black stone. I'll do that for $4. Ooh. Some nice pair. I like the, the zigzag lines. I'll do those for two dollars. It's magnetic. No markings on there. Looks like maybe something broke off the very end. Roman. I will do this one for two dollars. Oh my goodness, look how lovely that is. Lovely pendant, got some earth stones, lots of quartz in there, it looks like. Maybe some jade. Let's test these and see. Not moving too far up. Thinking maybe just quartz then. I will do this one for eight dollars this is going to be on the longer side all right we found the match to our vintage pair found the match to the bell earring let's just hit this with a magnet it's not magnetic i don't see any markings on it so I'll do those for two. Made in a Western Germany on the back. A little scarf clip it looks like. I'll do that for eight. A little enameled earring here. Another set. Also magnetic, I'll do those for two. Oh my gosh, so many sets of earrings today. I'm trying to go through these somewhat quickly, but 
so many pairs here. Love that ombre blue look. I'll do those. Let's see. Let's test it. All right, another Kim family. All right, looks like we have some whalebone on this one. Sterling on the back. All right, looks like it's probably a five and a half. I can't tell what that design is. Looks like maybe a mountain with some ships, maybe. Or maybe just some mountains. I can't quite tell. I'll do that one for 12. Beautiful sterling. All right, I found the match to this one. Yeah, there it is. Little leaves. I do go back through these usually to make sure I didn't miss any markings, but I don't think I see any on there. They are magnetic, so I'll do those for two. Look at this little one. 925 mark right there. Got some jewels in it, so let's see. No reading. Or just people with actually small fingers. It, it is adjustable. So I'll do that one for 10. Looks like we got a stone there. M B. The chain, the extender is magnetic, but this part is not. Very shiny, very pretty. I will do this one for eight. We are almost to the bottom here. Almost looks like some opal in there. It's definitely a costume piece, no markings. Something Marie. Let's look at these twisted ones. I don't see any markings. Let's see if they're magnetic. Not magnetic. I want to say these are sterling. They're definitely giving me a sterling look. So I'll do those for eight. Very thin. There is a name in here. Trafari. I think it says TM, so I'm not sure what year that is. I will do those for 12. Green stone in there. Goes into like a tie, right? Is that where it goes to? I'll do that one for three. All right, another match. Locked in together. They look like costume to me. There's a light baby blue. I'll do that for 10. Almost looks like a, the Roman. Same metal as that Roman. A little tiny stone. Almost like pinkish purple. Ooh. Pretty good reading on it. What do you guys think? No markings other than that. Okay, it looks like that's where that piece broke off earlier from the teddy bear. Look at that. Fish, ocean. I'll do that for 10. No readings on those. I'll do this for three. Another hat. The flower stuck in there. These have a heart, a flower, and a moon. Looks like the backing snapped off, but that can be easily replaced. Magnetic. I'm going to put those in a lot for now. 
let's say sweetheart I'll do that one for $2. And then the last but not least is going to be these awesome parrot earrings or toucan. What is it? All right, so this was an amazing box. We found tons of silver, lots of awesome resellable pieces some really unique pieces as well, lots of name brands. I truly cannot complain, some gold as well. I hope you all enjoyed this video. Please be sure to hit that subscribe button and until next time.